Hendrik, uh, when you mentioned before the 100 micrometers resolution, <clears throat> maybe uh, two questions to that. So resolution is, of course, also an interesting way to differentiate a DC product from, I would say, other line detectors, correct, and, and flat panels that are, mm -hmm. dependent, that are dependent on the scintillator layer to turn the x-rays into visible light and then finally, you know, excite the photodiode. And of course, as most of us know in this business, there is this horrible trade-off we have to make with the thickness of the scintillator and the efficiency. You don't have that problem, correct? We, we, we don't have that problem. So because we don't use as, uh, we, we don't convert from, from X-ray into light via a scintillator, we um, directly convert it. That's why we call it direct conversion through this uh, material called cadmium telluride. And no matter how thick you make it, um, the resolution still remains. So the uh, physical resolution of, of the pixel. So when you say 100 microns pixel, you actually also mean 100 microns resolution, which is in our world traditionally not the same thing, right? Correct, correct. Well, okay. That leads to my second question. Is 100 microns the end of the line or where does it go from here for you guys? Ah, uh, there, there, there. There is some, uh, still, still some fantasy here and real projects um, and uh, prototypes being built up for uh, 67 micrometer um, detectors, still remaining the same speed and uh, efficiency and all that, which is, which is key. Um, because everyone knows the smaller the pixel, the less sensitive and so on, but this is the big challenge. So um, the next step is 67. Fantastic. Yeah, that's really great. So uh, basically, uh, this challenge that many of our customers have when the pixel size gets smaller, they still need the efficiency because also usually the tube, the, the focal spot gets smaller and of course the power goes down. So you're, you're getting hurt both ways. Correct. It's a, it's a, it's a big trade off uh, left and right of the <clears throat> chain all the time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we can avoid uh, at least one of those trade offs, which is a fantastic advantage. So mm -hmm. great.